Hey guys, this is Vim91, and I'm talking about the PS5. Now, now many of you would probably know that there were some pictures of the PS5's dev kit leaked, and we've seen leaks before, and sometimes they're right, sometimes they're wrong. But here's the thing. You know how you can usually tell a leak is actually legit when the leak goes away really quickly, and what I mean by that? Well, sometimes you'll see a leak, like a picture or something, and all of a sudden, when you look for it, like maybe an hour or two later, it's gone. That a lot of times, in my opinion, means that the leak actually is legit because that means the company's like, oh crap, this is the actual leak. Let's get rid of it. So that's what they do. And that's what happened here. Because not only is the PS5 dev kit, and here's a 3D rendering of, of how it should look here. Not only was the post taken down on Twitter, right? But the actual Twitter account, it's gone. The whole Twitter account has been removed. So... To me, that means this is actually a legit PS5 dev kit model, and this is probably what the PS5 really will look like, because I don't believe Sony would have gone through the trouble of having the guy actually delete his whole Twitter account. Now, just to clarify, we don't know if Sony actually did it. We're just kind of speculating that Sony probably was like, hey guy, get the account, go, go. get off social media. We could have just been the guy to delete the account himself. But I really think that probably Sony was like, listen, we don't want this out there. And they probably convinced him or maybe the company he works for to be like, hey, get remove your Twitter account. Not even just the post. Remove the account. So it seems like these are the legit PS5 models. And if they are, they look kind of weird. They look like a spaceship or like a gun from Dead Space or something like that. But whatever, man. I mean, if this is how the model is, that's fine. I mean, I would like to see how the full model looks because it is true that dev kits in and of themselves usually look a bit different than the final model. So I'd still be interested to see how the final model of the PS5 looks. But what do you guys think? Do you guys think this is a completely legit link and that Sony actually convinced the guy or the company to completely remove his Twitter account? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. May God bless you all.